Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, SMW Outdoor Fishing Adventures. It's been a while. Um, again, I, I really apologize for not getting something posted. I think it's been like three weeks. Um, I've been having um, issues with my back. As If you're a new viewer or um, previous viewer or what have you, um, I had a bad accident in um, September and I broke but broke a T11 and, and T12 of my back. So it's been a really, really rough road here. Um, I thought I was over the hump, but I guess not of late. So, um, got to get this done. I'm getting really close here to get in the water again. Um, or we've had a un, um, it's just a crazy mild winter here for up, Upper Peninsula, Michigan. Uh, so, I got to get this taken care of so when the water opens up, we're ready to go. As you can kind of tell on back, I freshen up my backdrop a little bit. Uh, I got a little bit more th thing to do with it yet, but um, a little different, uh, so I hope uh, you enjoy that backdrop. Um, so I got a lot of things here to go through, a lot of mail, some product that I don't know what's here. Um, been gracious enough that a lot of people, they've been seeing some of my videos and um, they've been sending me things that I might like and uh, might not like, and so I've been kind of working back and forth with that. Um, so first thing I'm going to go through is um, my merchandise. Um, if you go to my merch, merch store now, um, I got quite a few products, quite a few drops. Um, always new drops coming, so uh, just follow the links and um, if you see something that you like, please purchase. Um, so basically, yeah, so what I have here today is uh, I got a mug. Um, Please excuse the uh, co the coffee uh, drippings. I had a little mess here spilt. Um, but this is what that looks like there. I wanted the logo over here, but that's, I guess, what you do when you do prototypes and that type of thing. So, um, so got this one for free. I got a hat and shirt also. This is a hat. Um, I don't know what you kind of material you would call it. It's kind of like that um, khaki, I guess, that like a khaki pants material. Um, it has the adjustable on the back, and it has the leather leather logo on the front. So yeah, so that's the cap that I'm comes in. I think I have like three or four different colors on there, uh, the cap, and um, so I'm just gonna kind of set this stuff down here a little bit. Same with the the t-shirt. It's a long sleeve t-shirt here. So um yeah, I'm gonna actually as we go here, I'm gonna order a couple more things. I want to get a dry fit shirt with my logo on, that type of thing. So uh that'll take care of that. Um there's when I when I was in my searching for rods and um I came across this company called Blackfin uh, Rods for mainly my spinning spinning rod rod and reel setups. Um, I thought I had a pretty good. Well, I, they actually named me to their pro partnership program. It's called. Um, we couldn't really get to a point where um, the percentage off was really um, cost effective enough for me to actually bring in the rods. Um, so basically we got a, they gave me a rod and merch type deal, buy a rod and get merch in return. Um, but you know, it just didn't seem like it was right for, for me. Um, but they're still generous enough to send me a, um, one of the UV dry fit, uh, hoodies, which I'll definitely, definitely wear it. I don't know if you can see it. It has her logo on the front there. It's a pretty color. I like the color a lot. Let's see if I can flip that up. Doing the best I can here, people. My back. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, what I'm trying to do is trying to find these companies, attacking these companies that, that are down south and um, See if we can get something going up here. Uh, it seems like a lot of these companies now they're um, oh focusing on like um, 
the down south fishermen, the the braids, the um, the offshore fishermen, that type of thing. And I think we're getting a little um, left out here, especially in the upper northwest, um, as far as you know, products and and that type of thing. So um, I might have to head out here. I got a couple other things that I didn't bring out yet that I, that I have to show you. Um, all right, the next thing basically is, um, I don't know, if, I'm sure you if you went back to my videos or, um, or even a new viewer, that type of thing. This is my, basically my baby. Um, I catch so many fish on this product here. Um, so what I wanted to do, I wanted to get a square bill and I wanted to get a round bill. Uh, I tried numerous, um, companies and I ordered them and the colors just didn't come right that type of thing so I decided to reach out to a gentleman and um, have them custom painted um, and this is reaction tackles little tackle tackle tracers 3600 if you want to go there and check out their products I'm on their pro staff um, This is what it is. Um, I don't know. This is what right here is what I, what I had, and um, and this is what we came up with. Again, it's the the square bill. Um, I think he's just starting out in his uh, his custom painting, uh, his air spraying. Uh, really, really disappointed because um, he added this to the to his color palette, and it's like this is his go-to thing that he put on his Instagram that everybody's gonna be following that color. Uh, I wanted it to be a signature color and um, like a one-off, and I talked to him about. It. He said, "No, if somebody wants that color, he's gonna do it for him." A little disappointed about that. Um, and a couple things too is when I first when he did my sent me my first batch, he never um, wrapped them at all. So you, gentlemen out there, if you're doing your your um, custom spray um, as far as on lures, um, make sure you wrap. You put those lure those uh, um, hook protectors and um, on the hooks and uh, properly wrap them. Because they came in, they were, he just threw them in a box. They were all tangled up. Um, got all kinds of scratches on them because they were fresh. It was such fresh paint. Uh, not ripping on them, but I'm a little disappointed that he, he did that. Just uh, used me, basically, to draw more attention to his program, and I didn't get anything out of it. I mean, I didn't. Um, so I guess that's the thing that kind of bothers me a little bit. I'm buying and buying from these people and giving them opportunity to grow their business, but at least they could do is buy a water bottle from me, you know. Um, so that's that. And I found another gentleman that uh, spray painted. Uh, he's actually local to me, and um, he's actually works at a body shop. And I talked to him one day, and I just went into his shop, and beautiful job, the scales and. Um, and that's that guy. I mean, that's, that's top quality work. And I mean, he, um, I think we did like 10 of them. Yeah, we got one, two, I think we got 10 of them made. He sprayed up 10 of them. So, um, so that's the round bill. Um, so yeah, that'll take care of my, um, signature or custom sprayed type lure. Um, that I was looking for. Um, let's get this set aside. Get a little sip here. All right. Um, last, like last year, I think I came across this gentleman um, that he does buying for all the e-commerce stores such as the Wish, the Timu's, uh, Cheyenne's, um, the AliExpress. He's an oriental gentleman that I've been dealing with and 
um, we stay in contact and if there's anything that I'm looking for he'll try to venture out and find and um, the only thing that that I didn't have here yet was um, he's finding me a I wanted a solid black um, bait caster so he's trying to search that but um, he sent me a bunch of more more of the um, of the rod grips and um, I wanted more I want to get my my channel more into the faith based um, I want to bring in more of the like the veterans type type co companies um, that the veterans or first responders that type of thing and um, and this actually uh, says urban God on it so I don't really know you I'm not sure if he had somebody make these up but um, but here yeah there's this basic um, grip wraps so you you know I got I don't know how many he sent me here probably 20 some rolls so that's got me set for a while <laughs> And he really takes good care of me. I got one other thing that he sent me that I'll uh, um, get off the camera, run and get him, and I'll put him. Let's see here. Um, another company. It's called um, Tackle Tackle Box Art Company. And he makes these type of type of things here. Um, you go back a couple videos. I did a, um, a promo video for him. Um, there again, please. You know, I'm buying their product. I'm doing promos and buy a water bottle at least. <laughs> uh, I mean, I paid for it. I didn't get it for free. So um, one hand washes the other, I guess. Today's video is sponsored by Dunbass Outdoor Apparel. They offer a wide selection of the dry fit UV protected apparel uh, ranging from your long sleeve tees to hooded dry fit to products for your youth and um, also they have a wide selection of hats, keychains and some flip flops. So go to www.dunbass.com and place your order today. Right, continuing on here yeah I thought that gives it would just send me uh, just a uh, what I needed but they're actually sending me a wide array of things a wide array of things here so I guess I have to kind of go through them here looks like this is kind of like a millipede they're all rigged up and ready to go Yeah, it's like a millipede. Um, I didn't expect any of this, really. I mean, I expect this what I what I asked for. And these are getting back in, like the tubes that. This is a, I believe, a three and a half. I believe. Well, anyhow, you have to go to their <laughs> their website. Um, this is actually too. Their what's nice about it, made here in USA. There's that color right here. I mean, it's really nice to set up. I mean, the hook sets in there. They have the little um, the little slot where you can actually just thread that hook in. They're really really nice. It's the only two bait only two bait I use, so I will not go to anything else. Let's see what else he threw in here. Bunch of weighted heads. Yeah, all the weighted hooks and let's see what else he got here. We got the green pumpkin. A 
those guys. What's nice too, I mean, you're not one fish, one grab, you're changing out your soft plastic. Um, get multiple casts with them so you're not changing all the time. And it looks like the June bug color. See what else you got. If there's something different, I'll show you. But the rest of these, I think, are yeah, the same one. Green pumpkin. It's the colors that I've asked for. Turn them brown. Yeah, these are the brown craw. Those guys. And what's nice about this company too is they imitate imitate the what's what's in foraging what's in your what your targeted fish is foraging, uh, whether it's crayfish or what have you. Um, that's what they that's seem to target for target with. And looks like I think I got a couple of these. Um, some crappie jigs they have those also um, for ice fishing or for pan fishing what have you. They come a little clamshell like that. And sent me a bunch of uh, bumper stickers again. One thing I don't know, I'm going to have to ask them, is that if they have any um, merch. So that's Gizzet. Gizzet, go definitely please go check them out. Um, i got to do a much, much better job as trying to tag all these companies that treat me so well and um, I'm trying to get better and hopefully I will get better um, so that takes care of that and another company reached out to me um, I, they're trying to get me to switch to their line I don't think I will but um, you know at this day in time you know as far as like being in my position as fishing as far as a professional level um, Cost matters, uh, shipping and that type of thing, and um, it's been really brutal. Uh, basically, on me, I went from one company that I got never got charged shipping to now. It seems like I get um, charged more. Um, so basically, to get my discount, I got to buy so much, and it's just I don't know. But I got to start looking out for me. I guess that's the number one thing, and I haven't really done that. Um, but this is a company. It's called Shark Shark Force. Um, they are actually overseas, and um, I got an email from them. And uh, again, they see my videos and what I was using. I use Ray Action Tackles. Um, lying probably 90% of the time, uh, but it needs nice to have that resource. You know that you know they're going to supply me for free and no shipping and so it's a sponsorship type full sponsorship type thing with them am i going to have to make that that move i don't know you know i mean i'm going to string it up half and half and see you know what it does if i like it well you know again i got to look look at my myself number one you know like i said there i mean i sent me probably i got what here I like the half too. They have some of the half uh, poundage. This is 14 fourteen and a half. They sent me eighteen and a half, seventeen and a half, and twelve and a half. And I got I think ten rolls of each that they sent me. What's this one? Looks like they sent me a ten too. So. Um, so they just spent like a um, hundred yard rolls they sent me, but I got they sent me like twenty of them. Um, so again, the company is called Shark Force. Um, again, I'll try it. You know, I you know they sent it to me. You know, no. You know, no price, no price tag, and no shipping. And I'm sure for them to actually send that overseas. And it's, cost them quite a penny so at least I can do is promote their product for them whether I do half them and half um, reaction tackle uh, so I guess that's that's another thing I'm really um, up against you know as far as watching 
what I'm spending, how I'm spending it, watching, you know, whether some of these pro staff situations are worth it or not. Um, but the companies that I have right now, I mean, gets it, you know, they set me up perfect again. I mean, I, it's a full sponsorship. Um, and I'm sure the deal with um, Dumbass, that's going to be an ongoing thing. Um, I'm going to promote and, you know, we can work hand in hand with product and promotion and that type of thing. Um, same with the artwork. If you guys sent me some artwork, you know, I'll definitely display it on my wall here. Um, like Arctic did. And um, buy quality, people. Don't buy, you know, there's so many, again, these pop-up um, tackle stores. You know, there's guys that are just going from this. They're doing it right to throwing it in baggies. Um, I am really, really defending these companies that are doing it right. Uh, for one, you know, I, I will not uh, support them for the fact that I know that they're not paying their, um, uh, all their liabilities as far as state tax, federal tax, blah, 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 seller permit. Um, you know, a lot of these companies, they're selling the molds for the soft plastics and all that type of thing. And uh, you go on there, you can just get a website for free. Uh, but watch, I mean, there's so much scams out there. Um, I, go, I go went through a lot of them and I go through a lot of them. I mean, they're all, they're all popping up on Facebook. There's thousands of them. Um, they're, there's not a place where you can contact them. There's not an email address, um, so I'm not sure if you buy them or if you're going to get a product. Um, but I noticed uh, the other day that somebody um, was doing some apparel and they're just, it was horrible. I mean, it, it was set up in their living room. They, it was just a mess. Um, you get into a company like Dumbass, um, gets it. I mean, all the companies that I'm basically involved with, I mean, it's all up-and-coming companies are growing every year and um, with these other companies they're gonna put these guys out of business and that's what happened in one of mine so far um, they did it right in fact it's a local company uh, Mickey Finn uh, they're doing it right and um, with all these other I call it backyard tackle companies and apparel companies are not doing it right and um, I did order, I didn't want to get into the bash, bashing thing, but I'm not even going to show it. But I ordered from one of these guys, and I think um, it was supposed to be a package of eight. And um, it was a mystery pack, got four, and it was just terrible. Um, the, the soft plastics, it wasn't trimmed on the, the excess um, um, plastic on the outside of the lure, wasn't trimmed. And um, there are voids. You can look at them, put it up in the light. There are voids through it, so you're gonna get a lot of cast out of it, maybe. Uh, so you might be paying maybe a dollar, fifty cents less, you know, per bag um, instead of going to a company like Gidsit or Castaic. Um, you know, these companies have the reputation in the business, and um, I'm out to help them and. Don't let these other guys, you know, put these guys out of business, you know, it just, um, it's just not right, it's not fair. Um, it's just like where the state I'm at, you know, um, I have my YouTube channel, I try to promote it, I try to do well with it, and some of these guys are going fishing twice and they're putting up a, a YouTube channel. Um, so hopefully somewhere, some down the line, YouTube will come up with some guidelines that'll um, deter, you know, these people just doing this, you know, making a, taking likes and all that type of thing away from me. I'm not going to get into his name. Um, it's an elite pro, and I made a comment on his post. Uh, he was going uh, kayak fishing, and kind of made me mad. 
you know, he's bragging about his kayak, he's got it sent to him, blah, 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 all decked out, and, um, it burned a, kind of, you know, I just, I texted him back, I mean, I replied to him, and he said, well, what do you want to get from this? It was nothing. It was the fact that he has his niche into bass fishing, boat fishing. Um, what I'm seeing now is some of these other elite pros. Uh, in fact, one of them, Mike Iconelli, he's all he's starting to fish the Bassmaster Kayak Series. It's not fair, you know. It's um, I can't fish with side scan and live scan, and they're getting all this high performance equipment sent to them. It's not fair to, to us guys, especially like me, that it's trying to do this to, you know, as a job. Um, so yeah, I got kind of not in a little, yeah, a little kind of a little tiff with them. You know, I said all the other, you know, when they're looking up kayak fish and seeing that he has all these subscribers, you know, it's going to go directly to, to him. It's not going to go to me because I don't have all the, the following that he has. And, you know, I just said, oh, let's just leave it to us, go kayak fishing without having a camera. Um, I know he has his right to do that, blah, 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 but it's just not, it's not fair to, to us guys, you know. Um, so yeah, we'll leave that at that probably for another, another subject, uh, another time. Um, but yeah, I want to thank all these people that just sent me all this stuff. Um, please support them. I'm going to do my best to um, lay down their tags. And um, if you go to um, Tackle, Box, Tackle Box Art Company, uh, if you follow uh, my link, you'll get 10% off um, your order. And um, I'm trying to think. We didn't do anything. I'm going to have to talk to dumb bass and see if there's any type of a discount there we can get working um but again you know the line company here uh shark force thank you for sending me that product and um the other poster made by the other company there uh black Fin, of course my merch merch company so yeah so that should be pretty much it for now hopefully it won't be long and um we'll be back on the water um I'm not sure when I'm going to be. <laughs> um, i got to have surgery again on the 10th of March. And um, hopefully I get good results this time. And um, I told my surgeon i got to be back on the water like April 1. So we'll see what happens there. And um, again, you know, um, all the tournaments are opening up down south. So we got the Elite, at, uh, Bass Masters Elite that's starting, I believe, tomorrow. Um, I forgot, forgot the location. The kayak tournaments are all heating up again. Um, so yeah, that should be pretty much it for right now. And um, again, if you're fishing down south, getting those boats out and kayaks out, uh, stay safe. And um, like, like always, take a kid fishing and practice catch and release. Until next time, bye.